Hey, what's going on, dive team? This is Mark with Jones and New Scuba here. Now, regardless if you're an experienced diver or new to scuba diving, there's going to be three acronyms that you're going to learn when it comes to scuba diving, which is BORF, STELLA, and SORTED. Now, we're going to go over all that here in a few moments. This is something that you're always going to be using when you're diving, regardless, again, if you're experienced or new, this is something you're going to use on every single dive. But before I get into that, you know what to do. Swim on down. Kick that like button, subscribe to the page if you haven't done so already, and hit the bell notification for when we upload new content. And with that being said, let's dive on into it. Subscribe to our page if you haven't done so already, and hit the bell notification for when we upload new content. So the first acronym we're going to go over is BORF. Begins with review a friend. Yeah, I don't expect you to remember that. That's not how I teach it. That's not how I learned using that acronym. So I use Bruce Willis Ruins All Films. Now, you can use whatever you like to remember, but for me, that's the easiest. So B, Bruce, stands for B, C, D. You're going to check your buddy's BCD, make sure it's not duct taped together, not make sure that there's in any zip ties holding that thing together. Make sure the tank strap uh, is on the back as well, and you're going to want to make sure that it inflates and deflates without leaking any type of air whatsoever. So again, B, Bruce, stands for B, C, D. W, Willis, stands for weight. So you're going to make sure you know where the weights are on your buddy at all times. Now, most of us do dive nowadays with integrated weight systems uh, in our BCD. Now, there are people that still do dive with weight belts, which is perfectly fine. Just know if your buddy is diving with a weight belt, their weights have to be a right hand release. So remember, check, make sure the release is right handed. If they are using integrated, you know where the weights are and you know how to remove those weights just in case you need to. R, ruins, stands for releases. So you're going to want to know where the releases are on your buddy's BCD, which is going to be the cummerbund. Also, you're going to have a strap around the cummerbund. You're going to have your chest strap. And then don't forget about the two straps here on your shoulders. There are two uh, clips there that you can push in or clip that will dump the BC off them as well. And don't forget on the back, your tank strap. That is going to be another release. So again, R ruins stands for releases. A, all, stands for air. You're going to check your buddy's air. You're going to want to make sure it's turned all the way on. So you're going to go to the back of his tank. You're going to open his air valve all the way up. Now, don't forget to give it that half turn back. If you don't know sure where the half turn is, easy way to remember it is, you're going to grab the air valve where you're going to open it. With your knuckles facing up, you're going to turn it so your knuckles are facing down. And that's going to give you your half turn back. Also, what you're going to do is you're going to want to check their secondary. That is your air source. So you're going to want to make sure it's working. You're going to go ahead and put it in your mouth. You're going to breathe on it. Make sure you can clear it. Make sure you can breathe out of it just fine because that is your air source in case something does go wrong. F stands for films and final O K. So remember that final OK, you're going to make sure your buddy is completely geared up ready to go and they are streamlined make sure when i say streamlined there's nothing hanging off them their low pressure inflator hose is connected everything looks good their pressure gauges uh, their depth gauge is tucked into their cummerbund or clipped onto their side and their octopus is going to be where in their triangle area so remember it's going to be in their triangle from their chin to their waist and over. Uh, that's gonna be the triangle area. So remember, BORF stands for Bruce Willis Ruins All Films, BCD, Weights, Releases, Air, Final OK. I hope you liked this video, and remember, check back next week to get the other two acronyms, STELLA and SORTED. And with that being said, stay safe and happy diving.